just put these in pieces in there, right in there. Morning, everybody. It's Friday, November 26th, and um, John is making crepes. It's awesome. Um, so, yeah. since he's making crepes and um, little girl's helping, uh, I want to talk about kind of food today. Um, one of the great things about having an RV um, when you have dietary restrictions is that you can do things that you might not be able to do in it if you did not have an RV. Let me explain. So we are a fully gluten-free household and partially dairy-free, so, which is, you know, challenging. So like the other day, um, we went to the restaurant, we had the RV with us, went to a restaurant, and essentially we had to get like half our meal from the restaurant and then get half from the RV because we couldn't like, you know, the potato couldn't have anything, a big potato couldn't have anything on it. You know, we couldn't have, she's helping. So like we had the RV in the parking lot, we had got our food from the restaurant and then we ate the food from the restaurant in the RV with our, you know, dairy free cheese and dairy free sour cream and gluten free rolls. And it's just, it's an interesting thing to think about. You know, if you're considering this lifestyle, I'm seeing a lot of my friends um, on social media, like getting RVs because it's really the only way to travel now. And a lot of us really need travel. Personally, I didn't realize until we got this RV about six months ago, how badly I needed to be in the outdoors more. It has been life changing for me to just have walks every morning and afternoon and at night. And yeah, you can do that when you, you know, live in a traditional house or whatever, but it's a lot more difficult to force yourself to go outside sometimes during a house when you're in an RV. I mean, right there, man, look at that. The outdoors is just calling to you and it's beautiful and we're blessed. And I, uh, if anybody is considering, you know, a, a, a mobile nomadic lifestyle, reach out, uh, comment. We're also, um, I'm on Facebook. Uh, and, uh, yeah, so just a dietary RV point of view. Anything else to add you guys? Say hi. Little girl, you want to say hi? Hi. No, she's like busy. Okay. All right. <laughs> Have a great Friday, everybody. Much love. Bye.